Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with foundation engineering in the topic of Tezagi bearing capacity theory. So the problem is a strip footing 2 meter width is founded at a depth of 4 meter below the ground surface. Determine the ultimate bearing capacity and net ultimate bearing capacity using Tezagi equation. Okay, so now uh, the given values width is 2 meter, so B is 2 meter and depth of foundation is 4 meter so these are all the given values and uh, the strip footing is found at the depth of uh, below the ground surface to remain the bearing capacity so then the soil is clay the phi equal to 0 ok so phi equal to 0 then c equal to 10 kilo newton per meter square ok power 10 kilo newton per meter square then unit weight of soil is 20 kilo newton per meter cube so unit weight equal to 20 kilo newton per meter cube okay so these are all the given values so corresponding to phi equal to 0 so we have to find out the nc nq and n gamma so these are all the bearing capacity factors that is the tesagi bearing capacity factors so the nc value is 5.7 and nq value is 1 and n gamma value is 0 Okay, so now for strip footing, the bearing capacity theory, uh, according to the Tezagi bearing capacity theory, so Q u equal to C n C plus Q into n Q plus half into gamma into B into n gamma. Okay, so this is a formula to find out the uh, ultimate bearing capacity. So now we can substitute all the values. So C into n C plus Q values gamma into df into nq plus half into gamma into b into n gamma okay so now we can substitute all the values over here p is 10 it is given into nc is 5.7 plus so the gamma value is uh, given that is 20 into depth of foundation is 4 meter into nq value is 1 okay plus half into gamma so the gamma is again 20 into b is 2 into 0 ok so this term will be 0 ok so solving this we got the value of 137 kilo newton ok per meter square so this is q u value so now we have to find out the net ultimate bearing capacity q n u equal to q u minus gamma into df ok so now uh, the QU value is 137 minus gamma into DF that is 20 into 4 meter. Okay. So solving this we got the value of 57.0 kilo Newton per meter square. So this is a net ultimate bearing capacity. Okay. So this is ultimate bearing capacity. This one is net ultimate bearing capacity. So this is the method we can solve the problem. Again we will see next video. Thank you.